Alô, amigos churrasqueiros. Hello, barbecue friends. It's great to have you here on our Churrasqueadas channel. And our recipe for today is redneck panceta, a masterpiece for you to prepare for your friends and family. Lots of people turn up their nose thinking that pork meat is very greasy. But is it harmful to your health? Along the video, I will talk to you about that, okay? We're gonna use panceta pork meat. This one, look, it's cut in a good shape, fresh cut. You can ask the butcher for it. Then, let's get a sharp knife and we are going to cut it like this. Look, the upper part, the part with the fat, okay? Hold it like this. Be careful not to get hurt. And keep cutting like this, this way, okay? The fat upper part, right? Keep cutting. Then you can innovate to impress your brother-in-law. You can cut it along crossways. Like this, look. Use a sharp knife, okay? Cutting it here, another cut there. Did you watch that panceta recipe we prepared the other day? We cut the meat crossways both sides. This one, we are cutting crossways only on one side. Click here, you will have more details about it. And stop fooling around, subscribe to our channel. Click here on the bell. You will get a notification every time we have a new recipe. Nicely cut, very fancy, looking good. We will start seasoning. Let's use some salt, table salt. Do not exaggerate. Let's use salt on the other side of the pork meat. Beautiful, beautiful stuff. This panceta here. Show you soy sauce. Give it a good bath with soy sauce. Garlic, well chopped garlic. Spread all over it. Red pepper. That dry red pepper, easy to find. Cumin powder. Then we will turn and finish the seasoning on the other side. Garlic. Soy sauce also on the side. Soy sauce, show you it's soybean sauce. Red pepper on this side here too. Powdered cumin, the same seasoning on both sides, right? Look, how beautiful. How do you season your panceta there? Tell us, I wanna know. I want to learn from you too. Seasoned redneck style to the grill. We are going to place it here on our barbecue grill. That sweet sizzling sound, wonderful. We are going to use this kind of barbecue grill around 30 inches from the ember, low temperature, around 20 inches from the fire, fat down. In a little while, we will turn them around and grill it on medium temperature. 20 minutes, okay? Look at that baby, check it out! Time to turn it around. It's already grilled on the fat upper side. Now we are going to roast the meat part. Show me the meat! Evenly roasted. Now we will turn it around one more time. Medium temperature, okay? To finish roasting the top part. Then, after finishing it, that hard work the barbecue guy is going to have. Now we need high temperature. That picanha steak temperature. To make it crunchy, you have to keep watching it here because it's fast. That sizzling sound, it's getting crunchy. Now, guess what? Let's jump on it, yummy. Look how beautiful that baby is. Wonderful, beautiful baby. Redneck panceta, it's very, very easy to prepare. It is very hot, ouch. In the meantime, Let's cut the chit chat. Let's try now our crunchy panceta. Listen to it, that's great. 
Wonderful, my friends. Listen, listen again. How tender it is. <laughs> listen. Whoa. Looks beautiful. In every panceta, it is good to use some lemon with it. Twist some fresh lemon on it. And since we are not doing anything at all. Mm. 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 Good, very good. It is really delicious. Guys, let me tell you. Delicious, this is a very tasty panceta. Remember I said before about pork being harmful to your health due to the amount of fat. In the past, pork meat was even called pig meat. Pigs were raised on the dirt, in the pigsty. Any type of food were fed to produce lard, but not today. Look at those over there. Check out the difference in the quality of genetics of the evolution pork meat here in Brazil. Today, pork meat is produced with tender, lean meat. It has much less fat content, it is healthy meat, and it is not harmful to your health. You can keep eating pork meat. Since you're not doing anything, good barbecue! <laughs> My beloved stepson. <laughs> right? The upper side. Stop flying. Isn't it flying? <laughs> Three, two, one, loud. Can I? Huh? Speak up, speak out. And Zelmiro has to clean his nose. Ah, oh, remember what I told you about pork meat? What was that? It's lard. No lard, with lard. What did I say? Fat. What I said was, if pork was really harmful, remember I told you pork was really harmful to your health. 